The Air Gun Advisor is brought to you today by Air Guns of Arizona, High Pressure Pneumatics, Michigan's premier air gun shop, RX Target Systems, and of course, Baker Air Guns. You'll find links to these and more in the description down below. What's going on air gunners? We are down here at the range today to test a new product by RX Target System. If you guys have been to the Pyramid Air Cup, you know something about the Speed Silhouette or the Gunslinger Challenge. Uh, a lot of different events have these, but Pyramid Air this year came out with a brand new target, or I shouldn't say Pyramid Air came out with it. RX Target Systems came out with it for the Pyramid Air competition specifically. And what's really, really nice is that it's quick to set up because in years past, I mean, the Pyramid Air Cup's been going on for a long time. The time it took to reset targets for the Gunslinger competition was ridiculous, and it made the competition go on and on and on. Matter of fact, we tried to hold one down in our club, and really, it just became time, too time consuming for us to want to do it again. This type of system is going to make it super easy. What, uh, what they've done here is like when you hit them, go down. Now, a lot of times with these style of targets, you have some bounce back, but look at this. You can see I cannot get any of these to bounce back up but with the lift of one bar they all reset simply so what's nice is how fast and how accurate this target system is now for those of you who aren't completely familiar with it these are set up at different ranges and it's first done first wind so you are competing against whoever is sitting next to you and it's a lot of fun it's a lot of fun for spectators targets are set up at 10 25 40 and 55 yards so at 10 yards you've got these chickens at 25 yards you've got pigs and then at 40 yards you have turkeys and finally at 55 you've got the rams and of course they go up in size the further away you get I am going to take my uh, one of my favorite semi-autos, and that is the Caliber Gun Springbok in 22 caliber, and I'm going to attempt to shoot these just so you can get an idea of what they are and how well they work. And man, you know, maybe sometime in the future, I might have a chance at winning that uh, Gunslinger Challenge. Watch out, Bill Rabbit. So let's go ahead and set these up, and we'll get back to the bench and have some fun after I get things sighted in. Well, hopefully, as you can tell, that RX target system, really well thought out, really well designed. Now, I'm going to go ahead and give it a shot here. This is the Caliber Gun Springbok. I'm shooting some 22 caliber, 18 grain JSB pellets. Um, I love this gun. It is absolutely one of my favorite semi-auto air guns out there. Matter of fact, if you haven't watched the review yet, I'm going to include that up here somewhere. You know what to do. But go check that out. Again, if you're enjoying this review, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up because that is really my form of payment for doing all this for you guys. Uh, I really enjoy doing it. Uh, that's probably why I'm a teacher back uh, for my normal job. So let's go ahead and give this a shot. See how fast I can do it. Now at the Pyramid Air Cup, you do have to switch magazines. You are going to be given 10 shots in the first magazine and then you can fill that second magazine all the way up. Uh, if you're wondering what scope I'm using, this is a Citron scope up here. A very nice little scope. And you'll also notice as you look through the scope camera that I have set up that, wow, it's getting windy out here, that it's not always going to be in focus. That is done strategically because I can't have all these targets from 10 yards all the way out to 55 yards in focus all the way. So what I do is I go ahead and focus at about 25 yards and then I know my holdovers for each one. Now I'm definitely not the fastest at this, but that's okay. It's a lot of fun. And if you have a club back home, I would encourage you guys to chip in and get some of these targets because they are a lot of fun. You guys can have a lot of good time doing that, talking about it, challenging each other to some good shoots. Enough talking though. Let's see how I do when I shoot these down. All right, I'm going to turn on the scope cam. Scope camera is rolling, I believe. All right. Going to load up my first magazine, like I said, with 10 shots. That's this one. Have my second magazine ready to go. Get those out of the way. Rack and load the first one. 
Now, essentially what you're going to do when you're at the competition is they're going to say, ready, set, go. And you go and it's all over. So I'm going to go on my first shot and see how fast I can really do this. Now, when I did this at the cup, I kind of messed up. I forgot how many, how many shots were in that first magazine. So practice does help. All right. Here you go. Let's see what we got. Turn this hat around so I can get in on that scope. Uh, there we go. So we got the pigs, the chickens, and the rams. Now the rams are in a little bit of a hole down there, so you see some a little bit of overlap on those, but that's all right. Get down here. Now the chickens are really, really blurry. Bring those into focus just a little bit. So you can see if I bring those into focus, you see what that does to everything else. So that's why I try to get something about right where the rams are, or not the rams, the pigs, and go a little bit further out, and then I can see the white blur for those chickens. All right, let's do this. I hope I don't mess up. Magazine change is going to get me. I bet it. I bet. All right, here we go. Ready, set, go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you gotta remember that magazine change. You gotta practice this at home. Get yourself some of these targets and get back on the scope. Done. Whew, I think I missed three, probably my own fault, but that's why you practice it. Guys, go check out this gun, Caliber Gun Springbok. Go pick yourself some up, some RX target systems. Absolutely blast to do. My only thing I'd add to this, David, let's get a string on each of those so I don't have to walk down there and pull that lever every time, but it does make it a heck of a lot more fun to shoot this competition. Hey, until next time, make sure that trigger pull stays smooth, those pellets fly straight, get that trigger finger moving fast, and we'll see you again right here on the Airgun Advisor. <laughs> that is so much fun. Oh, do I have another one? Oh, there's a golf ball. Oh, I'm all out of pellets. No. <laughs>